Start by going to the top right of your N8N dashboard and click Create Workflow. Then click Add First Step. In the search bar, type Discord and select it when it appears. Now you'll need to set up a trigger. You can use a webhook trigger to start just to get things moving, but this isn't the main connection point, so go ahead and close that for now. Next, click on Discord again in the workflow. You'll see two important options, connection type and select credential. If you're connecting a Discord bot, choose that option under connection type. Paste in your bot token, then click save. Leave the resource as channel for now, since we're focused on getting connected and not specifying actions yet. Next, under channel name, type in the name of the Discord channel you plan to use. Then under server, you have two options. Either leave it as from list and select your server from the dropdown, or switch it to by URL and paste your Discord server link directly. Once everything is set up correctly, your Discord icon in the workflow will turn green, confirming the connection is active. And that's how you link Discord to N8N in 2025.